Hey guys, what's up? This is Varun, and welcome to yet another episode of Mac Tips and Tricks. Taking screenshots in OS X is an extremely useful and popular feature. However, there are many users who don't quite know the different types of screenshots you can take, and there are some who haven't explored this feature into too much depth. The process of capturing what's in front of you on your display really is straightforward. Let's get right into it. Click on Applications and go into Utilities, and you will see a utility called Grab. Go ahead and click on that. Grab allows users to capture their screen in four different ways. Capturing the entire screen, a timed whole screen, a selection of a screen, and even a specific window. This is one way we can take screenshots. So if you go ahead and click on Capture and Selection, or simply hit Shift-Command-A, we will see a window called Selection Grab, and it says drag over the portion of the screen you want to capture. So just do exactly what it says. It's that simple. If we go into Capture, Window, or hit Shift-Command-W, we'll be able to choose the window we want to take a screenshot of. So just hover the mouse over the window. And there we have it. If we go into Capture once again, click on Screen, simply click outside the window, and you'll take a screenshot of the entire screen. Now last but not least, it's a time screen. Hit Shift-Command-Z or click on Time Screen in the Capture window, and you will be able to start the timer. And in 10 seconds, you'll be presented with your screenshot. Using keyboard shortcuts is by far the easiest and most popular way to take screenshots. To capture the whole screen, simply hit Shift Command 3. To capture a selection, hit Shift Command 4 and make a selection. To capture a particular window, so if I go ahead and open up Finder, simply hit Shift Command 4 followed by the spacebar and choose the window. We can even customize our screenshots using the command line. Let's get a clear window. If you want to disable the shadows from the screenshots, simply type defaults write com.apple.screencapture disable hyphen shadow space hyphen bool true if we want changes to take place simply type in kill all system UI server you can undo this action by repeating the same command but replacing true with false so let's type it again defaults write com dot apple dot screen capture Disable shadow boolean, or I should say hyphen bool, which is basically boolean, and this time we say false. And we should refresh the system UI server once again for changes to take place. Go ahead and hit enter, and you now have shadows enabled again. If you want to change the default image format of your screenshots, type in defaults, right com dot apple dot screen capture type and then you go ahead and type in your image format so I'm gonna get this to JPEG go ahead and refresh the system UI server so type in kill all system UI server to get it back to the original image format which was PNG Type the same command, but change the image format to PNG. So let's do that. Let's type in defaults, write com.apple screen capture. Type PNG. Hit enter and kill all system UI server. All the commands will be available in the description. That's all for today. 
I hope you've enjoyed this episode. Please feel free to contact me, either via personal message or email, if you need help with anything. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you for the next episode of The Apple Tutor. Cheers.